Hi guys, what's going on? So today in this video, I'm going to show you how you create a uh, appointment scheduler app or you say appointment scheduler chatbot using Dialogflow and definitely be using uh, Node.js for this particular project. So let me quickly show you the, uh, how it's basically working. So for this, I am just uh, open the terminal. I guess I already uh, terminal, let me for so starting terminal, then definitely you have to run the command either node uh, server.js and for right now, let's and so command is you know the server is so definitely I will run the command node.js and either if you install a package node name as node mods for this for starting this like npm install node mod. So this particular project, uh, this particular uh, package is used to run the server continuously and without any, uh, say, like uh, stopping the server. So I already have, so I just uh, terminate it and use the command node mod server.js. So it will start running and just for waiting for a second, it will give me the port name. Uh, the port is running the three thousand because I set up the uh, I set up the port. Either its port will be the ENV port, and either it is three thousand. So for uh, getting the HTTPS URL, we are definitely have to use an another package name as ngrock. So I just run the command ngrock HTTP, and the port will be three thousand. And just hit enter. So after running this command, it will give me two URL. So the, the first one is just an HTTP, but we definitely have to use the, this HTTPS one. So I just copy this one. Oops, uh, I just terminate the code because you know I just press Control C two times. So yeah, so you just you have to check this one time, Control C, and then just minimize this step. Uh, okay, so let me quickly show you the how basically the code is working. So the first we have to import the dialog flow project and after that, you know, we have use a package uh, of npm package of dialog flow fulfillment that uh, handle all the stuff uh, for the webhook side uh, in dialog flow. So also definitely we are using this express server. So definitely we need to have to uh, we have to need to import in the, our code and the node mailer sending the email to the node so and rest of stuff like the google apis because you know we handle the calendar stuff of the google calendar so definitely we have to need the google apis and axios is used uh, for right now we don't need to uh, add axios in this project hope so so i just commented or uh, and that i can remove it so oops so uh like by rest of stuff courses you know cross origin issues and here's a couple. So let me quickly go to the ng rock, uh, go to my dialog flow. So I'm here. So I just created a project name as a, a final scheduler. Let me quickly show you the engines. So, oops, let me quickly refresh. Okay, so right now you guys are able to see this. Like I just have uh, one intent because you know these all two uh, are the default intents. I just handle one single intent just to show you how basically you can handle the appointment stuff and how the appointment scheduler is working in dialog flow. So yeah, so and this appointment like uh, I handle some of the parameters like start time and time email because you know i'm also using sending the email in through uh through uh, google dialog floor you say like through chatbot you can send the conversation confirmation email and you say like the purpose of the email because that will be shown in the header of the uh both you say in the event section in the calendar and the email uh title and the name of the person that who want to schedule the appointment and definitely you have to enable the webhook 
and yeah this is all uh, from the entrance section you definitely have to paste the url that uh, the uh, android will provide us later so i just copy and paste this url and after that let me quickly see the which print i will head so this is the request this is the post request so i just copy this one and uh, paste it over there and i just hit the save button Okay, this is all set from the dial of flow side. All just we need to add the inter go to the integration uh, integration section, and after that we just go to the dial of flow messenger. And I just have to copy this uh, particular script. And after that, I already created an index.html file, so I just um, go on it and just. Uh, paste this script over there and after that I just have to click on go live to see in the web page so it's starting and because I, I think the system want to restart that's why I guess um, the system has left a little bit slow okay not a problem so after that it's running so now you can see the chatbot so if I say hi so it will ask the language will be changed but it's not a matter of the language we just have to check like the request is coming correctly or not so yeah this is the request is uh, coming correct let me change the uh, welcome message Okay, so uh, hi, I am appointment scheduler app, or you say like chatbot. Tell me how can I help you? So if I say hi now, so this particular probably this particular message will come. So I just Refresh the page and just uh, go to this chatbot if I say hi. So now you can see like hi I'm climb scheduler. Tell me how can I help. I say like setup and appointment. So at which time start appointment, say like then 10 p.m. So it will you know to send a message because you know I just put this on the intent section like the time the limit of the uh, time slot of the meeting will be 20 minutes. So I just give like 10 30 p.m. Tell me your email like come on and seven blade at gmail.com say like mental health please tell me your name I said I'm on Sheikh okay so congratulations your meeting is successful so let me see like either our meeting successful or not so yeah I think the status is saying the meeting is confirmed okay let me just check so you can see like event created and uh, blah 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 so these all are uh, these are the time slot is coming so for this i will definitely go to the uh, challenge section so i just open my google calendar and let's see okay so i just go to the time so it's a, i just put the time 10 10 am to 10 30 am so you guys see this it will create a schedule rating and so so if I did the first event with mental health so I I was giving more there to mental health and also let if I check my Google account uh, if I check my email so let me quickly check the email so you guys see this like the email is popping up and uh, you can able to see the time slot as well so yeah 
So this is, you know, the time slot uh, from starting. We can handle the stuff also like uh, in the, uh, you say like the time slot is same as over there. You can, you can also handle this stuff in the same manner as well. So yeah, this is all the demo, like how to create a chatbot uh, and how basically it's working, uh, how basically the dialogue flow integration with Google Calendar for set up the meeting and this this, this particular stuff and it was lots of stuff yeah, because you know this small, uh, every small stuff will need to set up and schedule the appointment so yeah this is all from my side uh, if you guys like my video you can definitely have to uh, you can definitely subscribe for more upcoming videos till then love us